Dohoi matey, Slashing Air Lucy here, and welcome back to Pokemon Sword. Now we are beginning to head up into the vault for exposition of some kind. We shall see what unveils. Wait, this isn't the vault. Oh, there's even more stairs. Look at all of these stairs and an item. Charm, just what I wanted. This must be the vault up ahead. Here we go, the vault. There aren't, there aren't any more items hanging around, right? I don't see any. All right, into the vault we go. What lies? Oh, it's Sonia. Hey, Sonia. It's been so long since I've seen you, I forgot the voice I gave you. I think it was kind of like a high-pitched thing. Like, oh, you're here. Brilliant, aren't they? It's great that there are still treasure tapestries that can tell us of Galar's history. Um, yes. The two youths watching a wishing star. Uh-huh. A disaster occurs. The two bewildered youths. Great, great titles for these. Fantastic. The youths looking on at the sword and shield that stopped the disaster. All right. And then they become kings. The youths being crowned. Wait. So, they, they rule the Galar region? These two people, these tapestries, tell the story of the creation of a kingdom in Galar. Yes. Say, young Jim Challenger, what sticks out to you most about them? Um, there's two or the darkest day. Y you're studying the darkest day, right? I, I think that's what I remember you're trying to do here. Right, that's got to be it. The story of the black storm that blotted out the skies was passed on through the years as a tale of disaster. That's what the darkest day is. Okay, yeah, that seems pretty obvious, though. Ha has no one really figured it out beforehand? Was there really only one hero, or were there two? And what even caused the darkest day? Uh, I, I can't say for sure, but I think it just has something to do with Dynamaxing. That's probably it. If that's it, this is going to be really boring. Where's the suspense? Where's the openings to multiverses? That's a thing right now, you know. Thanks for letting me bounce some ideas off of you. I think I've got some theories, too. Great. Yes. I'm glad that our conversation was brief. Although, I'm not sure how much was revealed. Bye, Sonia. I'm going to continue taking on the whole region. On to the next gym, so I can't take on the one here in Hammerlock yet. I have to I have to do one of these smaller gyms first. Oh, speaking of which, here he is probably to tell me I can't take his gym yet. Then, wait, what was the voice I gave him? The tapestries in the vault depict the heroes of the Galar region's past. I suppose if we got any modern hero, it'd be our champion, Leon. Listen up, Lucy. Your goal is to defeat the superstar, Leon. So go conquer Route 6 and trade yourself up along the way to Stowon's side. Okay, we've got it. we got to go to Route 6. Good. Goodbye. We continue. Route 6 is this way, right? It. Oh, they're battling. That's kind of cute. Fight! Win! He's going to totally win. Good luck. I'm off. What's that guy doing just standing there? Is there something over here? Uh, except for, uh, there's just a dude here. Hello? Oh, they're battle combo moves. Um, hmm, what battle combo moves does he, you know, he can only teach it to Toffee. That's no good. No. Toffee's not a part of the team anymore. We're, we're moving on to bigger, better things. Like going to Route 6. This is the way to Route 6, right? I wasn't really paying attention to the map. Yes, this is Route 6. It's very dry on Route 6. Oh, and we've encountered Team Yell again with a Silla Cobra. That is the largest head I've ever seen on a snake. Just look at those adorable eyes. That's the same thing my boss says whenever she looks at a lizard. Oh. They're making sure he gets a nice, peaceful sleep. Uh, where did this grandma come from? Hello there. If I promise not to wake the Pokemon, will you let me through? Of course, it'd be our pleasure. Oh, okay. They're just making sure it doesn't wake up? I mean, that's fine. 
Uh-oh. Hop. Oh, no. Hop's not quiet at all. You, you might want to do something, guys. Oi, Team Yell, don't you suppose you'll let us through? Now, you kids are way too loud. Can't be letting you through. Yeah. I mean, I, I, you could trust me, but Hop, man. Hop cannot be quiet. What do you say, Lucy? Oh, really? Fine. We'll battle them. This is all your fault, though, Hop. That they would have totally let me pass if I was by myself. But you started this. It's it's all your fault. You're just an instigator wherever you go, Hop. I don't know what to tell ye. you. You gotta, like, tone it down. You're at a 10. I need you at, like, a 5. So he's got... What is that? A, yeah, a stunky. Kylo will be just fine. Pluck the skunk. Yeah. It, it's going to be slow, but it's it's going to be who destroys the other first is what it's going to come down to. Ah, yes, excellent. Good attack, Kylo. Don't let that poison gas take you down for too long. You've got this. You're the darkest of birds. One more pluck ought to do it. Don't pay attention to anything that that stunky is doing. Just peck it. Peck its eyes out. Oof. Some damage at the end there. But Kylo's still fine. Was that it? Is there more? There's probably more because Kylo's still getting injured. Alright. Well, I don't think Kylo can take any more right now. So let's throw in our newest assailant, Vlad. Let's see what Vlad's made out of. Go! Don't let his cuteness fool you. Eventually, he's going to be a big, mean, lean machine. All right, let's do some air cutter. Air cutter's a great move. Oh, but so is Night Slash. Oh, that was unfortunate. Ugh, fine. Let's turn it over to Aku, then. Aku's got some pretty mean moves. Alright, Aku. Let's do Bug Bite. Because that one's super effective. Now don't die, Aku. Yes! What is it with this Pokemon being so durable? I mean, I love it, but it's weird. I have a feeling he's probably not going to make it through this last part, though. Oh! Except the other Pokemon went on the defense, which gives Aku the time to strike. Strike, Aku! Strike! Yes! And it's all over! Beautiful. We've done it. We've taken on Team Yell yet again for something pointless. Doesn't feel nearly as satisfying. Oh, I think I'll leave this to you, Lucy. Keep up the pace. Wait, what? Oh, I have to take on the other one, too? Thanks, Hop. Thanks a lot. Fine. Let's go back into it, Kylo. Let's just give it a pluck. Except it got to go first. Come on, no fair. Ugh, whatever. Fine, let's throw Eclipsa in. Eclipse is pretty good. Alright, let's do Electro Ball. I feel like the whole team's just kind of mediocre. There is so much potential amongst all of them. And would you stop with the Fury Swipes? Gee! Cut it out! Just let Eclipse do her thing, man. I spit all over the screen yelling about that. Oh, thanks. Now this is just going to be a disaster. Fine, quick attack. At least then we'll get the move in first. I'm so tired of the enemy going first. Although Eclipse is not going to make it through this. Nope. Boy, this is a lot rougher than I thought it would be. Fine, Maleficent, do something. We're not going to lose to a Lipard. Not today. Not today. Incinerate it. Don't let its assurance take you down. Oh, it took him down. Ugh. 
fine. You leave me no choice. I have to throw in Jesse and then revive Kylo. Well, this sucks. Me team is not great. Not great at all. But at least Kylo has some edge against dark moves. Ha! Jesse avoided the attack, though. Let's see if we can get some fight in with Jesse. Metal Claw! Don't let that assurance beat you up. Yes! Good work, Jesse. Excellent. Yeah. Now let's see if we can get something in that'll help Kylo get some swagger in there. Yeah. Yeah. Make it confused. Yes. This might work to our advantage now. You know, maybe I should catch a light part. They are pretty cool, and they are cat-like. I feel like there might be better things out there, hopefully. I don't know. It's on the defense now, so that gives us the opportunity to strike. Good work, Jesse. Ah, uh, Jesse's been proving our weight the past couple of episodes. Excellent work, Jesse. No, Kylo, you don't need to learn Scary Face. That is the most basic of moves. How dare you even ask to learn that? There, we, we won the pointless battle. We've done it. It doesn't look like it's awake to me. Lucy, you and... Bleh, I can't say Kylo's actual Pokemon name. We're brilliant together. And now what? See, Bidet really wiped the floor with me the last time we battled. And don't get me wrong, I can take a loss. Battling means you've got to lose sometimes. Um, are, are you sure? You, you, you don't sound like... But he said I was dragging Lee's good name through the mud, being so rubbish like I was. I just can't get those words out of my head. Yep, see, he got to you. You can't let Bidet get to you, Hop. He's, he's just annoying. Annoying people aren't worth it. If I'm weak, then people will think we... Lee's weak, too. But I don't want that. I can't let Lee get dragged down. He's the unbeatable champion. Yeah, but he also doesn't know where he is half the time. Y you get what I'm saying, Hop? I'm saying don't don't worry about Lee all the time. Be, be your own person. I'm going to have to take some time figuring this out. See you around, Lucy. Okay. And there he goes again. Don't look at me, man. It was Hop. It was all Hop. Yeah, that's right. Go after Hop. He's the one that caused this ruckus. Me? I'm going to call the... Wait, what? You're one of the gym challengers endorsed by Leon. Ah! Where did she come from? Oh, man. My name's Opal. If you want to know more, have a look at my league card. Is, is she a gym leader or something? She's dressed, like, very strangely. I'll keep an eye on you, child. I want to see what you can do when you go all out. Um, okay. Can I call it an episode now? Yes. No. Yes. Yes. Okay, we're calling it an episode here. So if you liked that, make sure to put a pause up and press that like button. And don't forget to comment and subscribe as well. And I will see all ye scallywags later.